Here is my initial setup. I have a microbit version 2 connected to a jack adapter. Also connected to the adapter are two jack DAC buttons. Pressing the button on the left shows an output of 1. Pressing the button on the right shows the number 2. And here is the make code editor screen for this project. On the right is the code, on the left are the buttons. Here I have added a third button. If I press the buttons as before, the left hand button shows the number one, the right hand button shows the number two, and at the moment the middle button doesn't show anything. And again, here is the code screen. This shows what happens when I plug the button in. Now resetting the micro bit results in the buttons being automatically renumbered. Now pressing the left hand button shows the number two. Pressing the right hand button doesn't show anything and pressing the middle button shows the number one. Using the method described in the documentation, link is shown below, we are going to add a third numbered button. First we go to modules, then we go to configure, we click on add. In this case we want a button. We shall leave the name as button 3 and we go back to the editor screen. Once the editor screen has reconfigured, we drag out another on button block. This time we call it button 3 and we say we want the number 3 to show when we press the third button. Downloading this new code to the micro bit and giving the system a couple of seconds to work things out. We now find that the new button is button 1, the left hand button is button 2 and the right hand button is button 3. We can temporarily override this numbering by clicking on the button label and selecting from the list the number that we want the buttons to be. As you can see here, I have just renumbered the buttons so that pressing the left hand button again gives us the number one, pressing the right hand button gives us the number two, and pressing the middle button gives us the number three. However, resetting the micro bit and giving the system a couple of seconds results in the buttons being automatically renumbered. Back on the micro bit, pressing the left hand button now gives us the number two, the right hand button gives us the number three, and the middle button gives us the number one. At the moment, there does not appear to be any way to make these changes permanent. This may not present a problem with a new project, but if you have an existing project with a certain number of buttons and then add other buttons to it, if the Jackdex system is going to renumber them when you reset the micro bit, this could cause a problem. This has been ranged with the Jackdex team and I believe they are working on it.